Hi guys, so I'm here with another video and I'm filming in a different location in my house today because I got a new package from Build Bear and do you see how big this box is? And it came when it's raining in Texas and it's actually raining like crazy in Texas right now. And so the top of the box is wet. When I carried the box in, everything was wet. It dried up a little bit, but I just did not want to take this up to the bear room because it's just too much. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the opening video here. Um, I look like a mess right now and I have my Hello Kitty hair tie in cause I just braided my hair real quick for this. So let's go ahead and open this. Uh, I did order a couple things that I really wanted from Billa Bear that they, see, you see how wet the box is that it's like tearing apart even without me cutting it up. So I finally ordered the jumbo frog that I've been wanting that always goes out of stock. Now that they finally have it in, I finally ordered it. So let's go ahead and show you guys what I got. Oh my goodness, this is huge. Okay, well, let's go ahead and start with the biggest thing in this box. Oh, okay, almost knocked the camera over. This is the jumbo green frog that I ordered. I am super, my dogs are just walking around upstairs if you hear that, but I am super excited about this because I've been wanting this for such a long time and every time I have the money to order it, it goes out of stock. So this is, look, you guys see how big he is? Like he is literally the size of me. Like I need to literally have, he's basically the size of all the jumbo bear, but I'm so excited to have him. and. My dog is right there. He loves stuffed animals, so he thinks this is for him. This is not for you. This is not for you. Stop. <laughs> okay, but anyways, this is how he looks like, and I love him so much. He is huge, and they actually stuffed it really well, because I know sometimes with Jumbo, they stuffed it. They stuff it, like, really flimsy, so it doesn't stand upright, but this stand up absolutely perfect so let me go ahead and move on just so i'm not focused on <laughs> that jumbo frog for the rest of the video though i wish i could because i'm actually very excited for it i do have three more things that i ordered so the second thing that i ordered is the um vampire teddy i know this came out i'm not sure if this is the first year that it came out or it came out last year i think it came out last year but i did not have a chance to order it so I finally ordered it this year before he is sold out and he is super duper cute. He is from Tim Burton, um, The Nightmare Before Christmas. Oh, lost my voice there, but he's from The Nightmare Before Christmas if y'all have seen the movie. And this is how he looks like. He's actually smaller than I expected. Cause like, I don't know if you could see, but his feet and his hands are actually really kind of tiny. Um, He's smaller than I expected. I expected him to be maybe a little bit bigger, but I mean, nonetheless, I'm not complaining. I think the detail in him is, or the detail on him is super awesome. And then they did like that little um, velvet nose on him. Like it's hard, it's like a uh, velvet nose on top of like plastic. And so this is how he looks like. And of course he has the Build-A-Bear paw print logo. Um, so moving on, the next item I have is Beetlejuice. And I know he came out last year as well. I did not get a chance to get him last year because he was sold out. So I decided to get him this year before he sells out again. Um, I actually have a couple of more of the Halloween stuff that I wanted to get. But it's just because I got the Jumbo Frog, I'm saving my money uh, until I have enough to order the other. And so this is his sound. I'm going to play it for you guys. Sir, yeah. sir. <laughs> so it's like a, I think a six in one little voice box. <laughs> sir, no. He's, he loves, I told you guys, he loves stuff animal. He's just like me. Um, and every time that an animal makes noise or something, like one of my stuff animal makes noise, he just like, it's like his thing. Like he'll just go for it. And then I guess 
I don't know why, but they didn't put his outfit on. Usually they usually do. So he has his little pinstripe outfit. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on real quick, just so y'all are able to see the full version of him. I mean, I'm pretty sure everybody knows how he looks like. So there's no need to, I mean, it's not a surprise to anyone, but we'll go ahead and do it for the sake of the full video. And then of course the pants. Oh, and I forgot to show the most important detail, the feet. You're distracting me. You're distracting me. Stop. <laughs> and he really likes colorful things. So he has green hair. So he's like hyper fixated on that. And he's just sitting there staring at it. Like he's just, like he's just on the hair. And so, no, baby, stop. No, he's trying to go get my frog. That's not for you. That's not for you. I bought you one. The one for you is upstairs. But anyways, guys, this is how he looks like with his full outfit on. Let me fix his pants a little bit. There he is, the gentleman. Here he is in the gentleman form that he is. And he is the little Beetlejuice tag right here. And then I think his hair glows in the dark, does it? No, it doesn't. There's another one that came out that glows in the dark. I think is the Boogie Man, I think, Oogie Boogie. Um, but this is how his feet looks like. Has his character right there, and then on the other side it says Beetle Juice. And this is his back with the little tail sticking out. And of course, I saved the best for last. You guys already know I had to get the 25th or 50, 25th, right? 25th year anniversary of Build-A-Bear Hello Kitty. And so, oh my God, she is, I love her so much. And you know, I don't get clothes for them just because it gets too expensive for me. So I only buy the stuffed animal, but um, her outfit, the outfit that they had for her this year was super cute. I think I might go to the store to see if they had any to order it. Cause I'm kind of regretting it now. Um, I wasn't regretting it when I was buying it, but I mean, it's only like 13, $14. So kind of regretting it now so i might go and check out a couple stores um tomorrow my day off just to see if what is this just to see if um they have any of the dress or any of her dress left and i think i might just go ahead and have to get myself one but anyways let's go into detail of how she looks like so she has her holographic little bows and this is actually attached on so it's like sewn on it's not like the um, if y'all, if any of you guys have the older version of the Hello Kitty where the bow is like basically Velcro so you can remove it. So this one is not removable and is actually sewn on. And then you could see the little um, basically uh, iridescent in her fur. It's kind of like a little scale looking. I don't know if you can see it if the camera picks it up, but it's kind of like a holographic scale. And then her, she has silver eyes and then the holographic nose and of course the um, silver threading of the whisker. And she has on her, basically her plain little bodysuit and then her feet. I wish they would have done something to her feet, like kind of put like 25th anniversary or something here, but they didn't. Um, and then this is her, I guess they did do a special stamp right here. So I don't know if you can see it, it says 25th celebration collection. Um, and then this is how she looks like from the bag. Of course, the Build-A-Bear tag. Again, I wish they would have just put something on the feet, but I am nonetheless happy. She was actually not that expensive. I believe she was $32. So it was actually not too bad. And this is how she looks like. And I am actually so excited with this package because this package literally has everything that I've been wanting to order for a long time, especially the frog and the um, two Halloween stuff. So the vampire teddy and the beetle juice, I've been wanting to order it. But by the time I was about to, they obviously sold out. So I'm trying to save as much as I can to get all of the Halloween stuff that they released this year, just so I'm not you know, pestering myself or blaming myself, regretting not ordering them. But anyways, that is it for this video. And of course, the certificate. And I think, oh, wow. Oh, there's this no, I thought it was a different certificate because it was, oh, they did do it different. So um, the certificate says 25th anniversary and it's, it's not like the blue anymore. It's kind of like a silver print now. 
So that is super duper adorable. But you know, I don't really use this. After they took out the online thing, Build -A Bearville, I don't use it anymore. But anyways, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I know I've been talking a little bit more in this video only because I'm in a different setting and I don't know how to act. But anyways, I will see you guys next time with the next Halloween package opening. Thank you for watching. Bye.